Oh, here's the bowl. And the goat. And we are in Winthrop, Washington. And uh, we have uh, stumbled across this little town. It's a beauty. It's fashioned after the Old West. And uh, one of the stores here is a, a glass blower. And it's uh, Glassworks of Winthrop. And uh, we're here, and Garth is uh, about to make some shot glasses. Shot glasses. He's about to make some shot glasses, so we're going to show you how he does it. Okay, I'm ready to get some glass on the pipe. It's in the furnace. It's like honey in a big pot. So how hot would that be in there? It's 2100 degrees Fahrenheit. 100 degrees Fahrenheit. 2100 degrees Fahrenheit. Twi Whoa, okay. I roll that on the marker, that's the metal table. Gets it off the end of the pipe. And I'll roll it on chips of orange glass, it's called frit. And I'll melt that in. I melt it in the glory hole. It's also around 2100 degrees. So what did you call that? The glory hole? Glory hole, yeah. 2100 degrees. Because it's bright. Now I'll marver this again and then I'll blow the bubble. Now I'll give it another heat. And I'll swing the glass to stretch it. So you're stretching it now. Yep. And I'll make a place for it to break off the pipe. With jacks. I want to make sure it's a nice size here. Now I'll get the foot. steel rod. I'll marker it. I want to put it on the bubble. I like to have it centered. I'll use my diamond shears to cut it off. I'll give that a little heat to heal up the snip mark. shape it with an optic mold. I'll make sure it looks good. And I'll pop it up so it sits on sort of a ring. Now I'm ready to break the glass off the pipe. Onto the punty. So I'll get a little more glass on a smaller punty. Shake that. Now I'll make sure it's on center. Drop of water and break the glass off the pipe. Now I'll open it up after I heat it. So that was just a drop of water that did that? Well, yeah, the water helped stress it out. Of course, the big thing was I made a mark that was nice and clean with the jacks. If that wasn't good, it wouldn't break so easily. Okay. Sorry, hang on, Garth, you got that truck. Okay. It takes a little while for it to get hot. Takes a little while, okay. Yeah, just watch for it to yep. lose its sharp edge and maybe it'll move a little bit. I don't want to let it get too hot or it'll get thick on the rim. We don't want a thick rim. Now I'll open it up a little bit with the jacks. I don't want to press too hard or I can knock it off there. I'll give it another heat. 
So how many, just out of curiosity, how many shot glasses do you reckon you made in your time? How many have I made? Yeah. <laughs> in my time? Yeah. Man, that kind of sounds like I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> so, I don't know. Not, not too many. Probably a, a hundred or something. I don't know. Okay. But I, I've got an order for eight of these. All right. Of each color. And, uh, of course, to get eight that match, Nicely. I may have to make three or four of each color, but that's okay. I will always be able to sell them. Yeah, I'm sure. I've made a lot of different shot glasses, and this is the one I enjoy making. Okay. Mainly because it's it's really different. I, I don't see anybody else doing it. Of course, uh, if it gets on YouTube, who knows what will happen. Well, you never know. Yeah, it could go viral, right? <laughs> They're giving another little heat. And they're small pieces like this and fairly thin. They cool quickly. Okay. So I, you don't have a lot of time to work with. Couple here that match pretty good. Well, that's close, it might be a little tall. But we'll, I'll make some more. Certainly, one of them will match sooner or later. Oh, absolutely. Now, cool the punty where I joined it on. This will help it break clean. Make sure it's not sharp. Put it in a big oven to let it cool slowly overnight. And take the stresses out of the glass. So it will be done tomorrow. All right. Now, of course, I think you're going to have to watch something just for fun. I think you might enjoy this. You brought your hearing protection, didn't you? Oh, hear that? Hearing protection? Yeah. It's this little thing. It's built in. You activate it by pressing on it. All right. Sweet. Yeah, I have store bottoms. <laughs> <laughs> well, you may want to use yours. You're right. You got your hair. You do your ears. It's a glass. Start a bubble. It's probably going to pop when I hit this. Here we go. I'll give it my best effort. <laughs> Did you jump a little bit? Oh, a little oh, bit. Good, good. <laughs> I had my ears plugged, but it was sweet. Yeah. That was a big bubble.